The market's currently in a transition in small form factor devices from risk-based, ARM-based uh, products that were, they used a certain classes of software, but not the universal classes of software we're used to in, in personal computers. We're now finding that x86 processors will perform in smaller, ever smaller form factors, and at the end of the day, that forces the, the risk-based, the custom chips, into ever smaller forms. So what we're seeing is a migration of technology that's common on the desktop migrating down to a point that we can actually carry it and eventually put it into our pocket. This class of device has a number of core requirements. Uh, battery life, uh, it still has a, an adequate performance requirement. It has to be inexpensive enough so that people can buy the device. Uh, it has to be secure enough because people are still putting personal information on the device and the device is small enough to lose and so they don't want that, that, that information lost. And so that really takes us down to really the only two vendors that are currently active in this space which are VIA and Intel. Intel comes in at the high end of the market, VIA comes in at the low end of the market. Both of them are chasing similar kinds of ideas. Both of them have the capability of doing everything the class needs to have. The question is, for a small device, where are the price points? And our experience has been the price points tend to start at least where the volume is, at the lower end of the market and not the higher end of the market. That's where the battle is probably going to come down. It's not necessarily what the two vendors can do because they can do similar things. It's where the market wants the price point for the devices they want to purchase.